welcome back to another video and for this video i'll be looking at methods of proof using logic theory and we'll be looking at counter example direct method contrapositive and contradiction and the first one we'll be looking at is counter example so this method is useful in disproving statements of the form for all x such that p of x or prove there exists an x such that p of x so here we have an example for all positive integer n, if n is prime, then n plus 1, n plus 2, n plus 3, and n plus 4 are prime. So what we need is 1n, which disproves the statement. So since we have a statement of the form for all x, for all x we need to find an n an n an example which would make this statement false So let's go ahead and list our prime numbers from 1 up to 29. So we have 2, we have 3, we have 5, 7, 11, 13, 17, and 23, and 29. So we're going to try all these possible values and see which one gives us not non prime numbers so for n equals 2 we see that if we add n plus 1 then we have 3 then so that's out so for n equals 3 if we add 3 plus 2 we have 5 that's a prime so that's out so for n equals 5 if we had 5 plus 2 that's 7 so that's out so for n is equal to 7, if we had 7 plus 4, then that's 11, so 7 is out. And for n is equal to 11, 11 plus 2 is out. So for n is equal to 13, n plus 4 is 17, so that's out. And for n is equal to 17 we have n plus 1 is all 18 n plus 2 is equal to 19 n plus 3 20 and n plus 4 is equal to 21 and therefore true for n is equal to 17 so therefore we have found an n which makes the statement false and so by a uh, counter example by counter example we have found we have proven rather that the statement is false 